On Saturday, we met with 13-year-old Wyatt Wilms from Arizona about his first U.S. Nationals. You might have also seen him in the fourth issue of this year's Arabian Horse Life magazine. We also met with Chelsea Wesson, whose horse started out as a trail horse and is now a national champion. I'm Wyatt Wilms. I compete for Jeffrey Wilms Training and Management. It's my first U.S. Nationals. I've gone to Nationals for youth, youth Nationals. I've been there a few times. Won a couple national championships there. Competing with the upper grade, it's, it's nice. More competitions, a lot harder. So it really puts you on your game. You really have to focus and just try your best, really. Trail, it just pushes you. You have to make your horse do something that's hard, difficult. You gotta slow him down, make him do something correctly, maneuver him, stuff like that. Last year, I got Rookie of the Year for rodeos all around, won a couple of cuttings, a couple of cow horses, stuff like that. Went to Rodeo Nationals up in Gillette, Wyoming. Competed against 300 kids for rain cow, 400 kids for uh, cutting. Rain cow, um, I ended up 20th throughout the nation. Cutting, about the same. It's pretty awesome coming here and it's fun. It's a new adventure. My name is Chelsea Wesson, and this is P.A. Layla. We're from Illinois. Layla is a 13-year-old purebred Arabian. We actually bought her to be a trail horse for my mom, and it was pretty evident within my first ride that she was my horse. I've uh, been pretty special because uh, I did her all by myself for the first, I believe, three years that I showed her, and we um, had a few national top tens in Canada. Uh, regional championship in the amateur owned, trained and shown in region 11. We were here two years ago. I was with a friend and I watched what would be our class and I said, I think she can do it here. And last year I put her in training and uh, that was a little hard for me because I'd done everything on my own up to that point with her. And uh, she went into training then and um, we took her to Canadian Nationals and were lucky enough to be named uh, Canadian National Champion. I knew as soon as I rode her, you know, she has all the, she has four high whites, super flashy, um, has a lot of presence and very charismatic and she's just a happy horse. Just really showy and likes to show off, likes being around people. I had to spend uh, a whole summer getting her back in to show shape and um, I like Hunter Pleasure and it was pretty clear that was what she was suited for. So that's what we've done. It was a really good bonding experience. We did a lot of um, trail riding for conditioning. Um, we have some good hills on our farm. So lots of walking up hills and um, lots of hours in the saddle. Just easy and yeah. Didn't know what I had, I think, at that point. I think I knew I had a good horse, but I don't think I knew I had a horse as good as she ended up being. But the bonding was the best, I thought. We still, when she's at home, we go out on the trails all the time, and we have big fields in front of our house, and we'll go out and gallop in the fields, and she loves it. It's a really good break for her. Stay tuned tomorrow for more exciting classes and impressive competition. Also, make sure to stop by the shopping expo and see anything from fine jewelry to tack for your horse and apparel.